Oh yeah, you could actually stick it even closer too. Right there. Like almost get it right on it. Right there. Yeah, like that's what I would do, like that. Ready? Almost like that. And action. There you go. All right, so but it's just a test run, so it's okay. So, uh, so Judy comes to me, and Judy says she got dumped. Oh my gosh! I know. It's not what I said. Does it well, hurt? every time I say that, does it hurt worse? <laughs> no, what I said. See, this is again Billy's paraphrase. I said it right this time. Basically, it was the nicest way that a man has ever kind of dumped you. Not dumped. Put me on hold. I'm on. Put hold. you on the back burner. For now, he's, you know, I, I gave him, I guess, great advice he took, and that was yeah. uh, soul searching. The best thing that Judy gave him out of the last three weeks was advice on how to dump her. <laughs> Way to go. I know, but he was really sweet. And I mean, we it, look, he wants to find himself, and I've we've all been there if you've ever been through a divorce, or, you know. Um, and I basically said to him uh, about a week ago, I said, you know, the, your true soulmate is the person in the mirror. And until you find that person and love that person, you can't really find another love. I think you. Agree. So what he did was he looked in the mirror and he thought, "Hey, I like you more than Judy. <sighs> no, Look at you. No. Maybe I don't like redheads. No. Maybe I like middle-aged balding men. Now you got my little back of my head voice going. <laughs> well, actually, that's what he your really. Your hair's kind of sticking through the front too. <laughs> right? I know, it was fantastic. <laughs> no, because he said he goes, "I really like you. I love our conversations." He goes, "I want to build right. a foundation before I like, and then try to build." But did he with give you. you the green light to see other people? He never said it, but I mean, can I? How long is this going to take? Yeah. This so, soul but, but, if he, but if he said, I need to take some time to find myself, and hopefully you'll still be available and we can build something together, then the, he's basically also saying, but I, it's okay if you go out and see other people. Oh, okay. Well, right? that's kind of what he said. He didn't so, say, he said, I want to build a foundation for us. He didn't right. say go out and see other people. But have you noticed this is only a few weeks away from Valentine's Day? I, listen, he has stolen a page out of Billy Greenwood's playbook. Break up just before Christmas, break up just before Valentine's Day, and of course, your birthday. Three of the most expensive holidays every year. And then uh, once I find myself and the holidays passed, On if you're still available, <laughs> let's get back together. So in other words, February 15th, he'll find himself. In the meantime, Judy Diamond, back on the market. I need a Valentine. Good right. luck with that. Yeah. And by the way, a side note, uh, voting is underway for the A-list. Yes. We want to be A-listers with you. We have been uh, We have been fortunate enough to have been nominated in the past. Is this with like uh, uh, Riverfront Times? St. Louis or, Magazine. Uh, STLToday.com, I think is where you can vote. Yes. We have the link. All, and it's not even voting. We just need like for you to nominate us. I'm so looking. you just go to the best morning show and then just put in Billy and Judy with an I. Right. It's stlmag.com. stlmag.com. I was way off on that. <laughs> That's why you just go to our Facebook page and the link is right there. And then you vote for or nominate Billy and Judy. That's Judy with an I for Best Morning Show in St. Louis. Please, please, please. Even if it ain't true. Please. There you go. Yeah, because we can keep our jobs, right? Back on the market. Vote for us. Thank you, Thank you for listening. Thank you. We love you. Is it off yet?